can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. A storm? Oh no! The raft! little things from my dream I I can't seem to hit them and they seem to be swarming me that is not good well we better get the heck out of here ah they're everywhere so many things I can't kill it makes me angry where's Kyrie I thought she was with you the door is open what? The door is open, Sora. Now we can go to the outside world. What are you talking about? We've got to find Kyrie. Kyrie's coming with us. Once we step through, we might not be able to come back. We may never see our parents again. There's no turning back. But this may be our only chance. We can't let fear stop us. I'm not afraid of the darkness. Riku? Interesting, but now I can hit them and by hit them. I mean one shot I love being overpowered in games Let it be known that so now that I can actually hit these things Mayhaps I should bio them or perhaps I should wait until we get a proper introduction to what these creatures are Yeah, I think I'll wait until we get the proper introduction because I'm also waiting on uh, something before I bio things because I want to try and do a little bio template. But they drop one experience, but they swarm on you like crazy. But they're adorable. And they make plushes of them. Very sadly, though, it was only available on... When HD 1.5 was first coming out, there was a... Uh... There was a special edition that was released inside Japan that came with a special plush of these creatures. And I was totally going to get that. Unfortunately, it costs like, I think, 120 bucks. And that's not including Im importing fees, like shipping. So I ended up not getting it. And I was so sad. Like, so very sad. But, we better find Kyrie. She's apparently somewhere on the island. We've already lost our best friend. Because he wasn't afraid of the dock. Which, I mean... I, I, I'd like to point out how he goes, We'll never see our... We may never see our parents again. I'm pretty sure you don't have parents, Riku. Because for the rest of the series, we will not hear a lick from their parents. Sora's mother is the only one who we actually hear from. I love that they just... Ex oh! Well, I know I can't get synthesis items yet because of that, but I wasn't expecting that drop. Then again, I do have Lucky Strike on. Lucky Strike is an ability that allows you to get an up chance for enemies to drop items. Oh, wow. I'm getting... I got two of them. I'm rather surprised about that. 
All right, let's go up right here. Just keep watching as they appear. Like, honestly, at this point, I'm just wasting time. That's because I'm trying to split things into parts. Gotta protect the island from these monsters that are invading. Come on, as a kid, everyone wanted to play like the magical person who would defend their home from monsters. In, in some capacity or another. Plus, also, I get to hear Night of Fate, which is an awesome track by Yoko Shimomura that unfortunately does not get played too often in this series. Like, Night of Fate honestly shows up in Kingdom Hearts 1, Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. Oh, wow, another one. Uh, Rechain of Memories. I think it shows up. Yeah, in fact, I'm positive it shows up in Recoded. Um, got another one. Grab the potions. I didn't max out on potions, so this helps. I can kill you. Nope. Nope. There they are. I figured that there'd be more up here. I wonder how much until I get to another level. Actually, check. I've got a lot more things I gotta kill. Like, a lot more things I gotta kill. Like, I'm not gonna level up on this island. But then again, we're just about out of the tutorial area. Oh, now I'm getting stun impact. Stun impact is an ability that was added into Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. Pretty much creates a barrier around you that if enemies are caught inside it and hit by it, will stun the enemies, which is actually a rare thing in this game because not many enemies get stunned. Nope. Nope, get back here. Let me, let me climb. Okay, you're just gonna jump down there, okay. Sure, why not? I, I, didn't, I didn't wanna hurt you. Nope, come back. All right. And it looks like the secret place has a secret door. Hello. Stop hitting me. I think some actually, yeah, some spawn right here. I'm literally just wasting time at this point. But I, I do like getting potions. These potions actually do heal me for a lot in this early part of the game. I couldn't remember if some of these little guys spawned inside. There I go, gendering them again. Uh, well, then again, I say guys in a non-like gendered way, so, eh. Anyway, let's go to the secret place. Maybe Kyrie's here. I can't move the camera in here. Interesting. Hello, dark side. We meet again. Watch how fast you go down. All right, I want. No, I want tech points. Tech points. I should. Yeah, I should probably just not be locked on so then I can actually move the camera because that's the downfall of having full 3D camera movement. Oh, got punched right in the face. Stun impact. Ouch. And goodbye. I think scared dark side. Won't be seeing him for quite a while. 
And there I go, gendering them again. I'm not gonna point that out every time, just know I, that's just something I do. dream. A lot of lights all over the place. Red light district? But, welcome ladies and gentlemen, to Traverse Town. Our first new world, as it were. Why don't we talk to some locals? That's a good question, person who looks a lot like Titus, but is not Titus. What about you, little Moogle? Okay, little Moogle. What about you, lady? Okay, sounds like I hit a nerve. What about you, good sir? Okay, that's good to know. So, let us look around, see what we can find. We got boxes. Let's push this, because I want to get to the roof of this building. If I can at this point, I don't think I can. Oh, I can. Sweet. Why? Because there's a chest up here that, if you open it up, contains a postcard. This is a side quest that is inside of Traverse Town. There are ten postcards for you to find hidden around town. Get all the postcards. You will get prizes for each one you turn in, and they get exponentially better. Where do you turn them in? You turn them into the mailbox. So send ten postcards to win something. Good luck. So, first postcard. We get a cottage. What is a cottage? A cottage restores your health to full as well as restores MP to full for you and your party. Something I don't use too often. Ooh, what about you, good sir? Okay, and this is currently closed off, but what does the Moogle have to say? Super weapon forging, A. Eh? Why, that sounds like something that will be helpful for later. Come back over here. Open this up. Can I... Can I open it? Nope. Okay. Well, it is a big old safe that requires a big old key. I've got a big old key, it looks like, so... Oh, well. Why don't we go into the second district?
Hmm. Alright, I guess we'll go into the only store that is available to us. Well, there are two stores that are available to us. So, let's go into the accessory shop. Sid, as in Sid Highwind from Final Fantasy VII. Unfortunately, he had to quit smoking because Disney wouldn't allow him. Aw, oh, that's sweet. Which is why I just attacked your countertop. I did not mean to do that. I keep on forgetting that the X button is attack in this version. But, open this up. Get a Mithril Shard. Mithril Shards are synthesis items. Synthesis is used to make new items and or weapons in the game. But, um, hmm, how long has it been? It's been a little while. So anyway, guys, I'm actually gonna end it off right here. This has been Roxas1359. Next time, we're going to be exploring around Traverse Town to see if we can find Riku and Kairi. See you all next time.